So I know the goal this year was to win more than five dual meets. Yeah. So what's uh, what's kind of the approach to this season compared to the last few seasons, and when did you kind of see a change in the kids? Oh man, we've uh, <laughs> we, we've had rough times through here. Uh, last year we really kind of turned things around. I mean, really it started two years ago. We had a goal of win one meet, and uh, everyone bought into that, and we won two meets. Mm. So that was really cool. And then last year we said, all right, our goal is to win three. And you know, everyone banded together, did some things that they weren't comfortable doing, and we won five. So you know, it, it's just a, a mentality of uh, these kids that just kind of buying into buying into what their coaches are saying, um, doing whatever we can to. To help the team, and that's you know everyone's just kind of you know, been all in on that. And it's been fun to watch. I've okay. seeing we've had situations where we've just needed someone to go jump over some hurdles to get points, and mm. guys that have never done it before. We're just like, all right, let's go. I'll do it for them. So it's uh, it's been fun to see. Now, did you change your approach to coaching at all over that that span, or was it just kind of the kids kind of committing more? Oh, not even not even once. I mean, we we uh, between me, Coach Niehaus, our throws coach. And uh, Coach Taylor, our girls coach, um, we're all on the same page. We uh, we really push our kids to the limit, you know, every day in practice, and they respond well. Okay. And that's that's the biggest thing is getting kids out that are going to respond to what we're saying. I mean, and they know, you know, at the end of the day, we, we love them, we care about them, and that's that's where, you know, that's where they really buy in, and you know, they're fun to watch when when they go hard like that for everybody else. Have the seniors kind of been the catalyst behind the change? Yeah, okay. yep. We've had, I mean, they've, <laughs> I mean, uh, our senior class when they were freshmen won one meet and and got, you know, beat up in a lot of them. I mean, they, they've they have seen the, the worst, they've seen the best. And, you know, once they figured it out last year, like, hey, if we really want to get fast, we got to run fast. And once they figured that out and everyone was in together pulling on the same way, it, uh, it really turned out to be something special. Uh, last year, was there a certain point where you could see the change in the kids? Oh man, I would probably say uh, real early in the year. Um, we hadn't we hadn't swept a dual meet in probably seven years up until that point. Until um, our first home meet last year, um, it came down to the four by four like it did tonight, mm -hmm. and uh, you know we had just a really gutty performance. Um, and we ended up sweeping that meet and just seeing the reaction of those kids and just being ex as excited as they were, like we just kind of knew that, you know, Grass Lake Track was gonna come back to, to be something special. Okay. And, now, you know, and we're not, hey, we're not competing for the state, for state championships or anything like that. I mean, our goal is to win the, is to win the league and we've got some tough opponents in this league. Addison's outstanding, Hanover's always outstanding. Um, but to not be at the bottom and to be flirting with the top and maybe stealing some beats from some teams, you know, that's that's kind of where our sweet spot is right now. And then eventually, you know, the goal is to keep building and keep building and, you know, take this place back over.